<laughs> oh, good, Zena. Good. I'm doing good. Thank you. I know. I know. And, yeah, I know. She's okay now, though. Yeah. Oh, Chad is split, split now, too? Oh, my gosh, Webb, you are just a doll. I'm doing great. Thanks, Hen Cass. <laughs> it's Webber. It's Webb. Wet Webb. <laughs> Hi, Al Skates. Um, well, this box here has been being squished down by a black, one of the black cats all day long. And... This one back here was starting to be squished yesterday. <laughs> Aww. So they they have fun. Oh, oh, Wabby. Yeah. Yes, but Gossamer, I just, just sent you an email back. I just did. <laughs> Millboards, I don't know. But... Oh, I could find out for you. Dove is doing really good. No, I don't think it's damaged. I, well, I hope it isn't, but we'll check. Um, uh, Dove is actually doing really, really good. Thanks for asking. I'm. Uh, she amazes me. Uh, you can tell she feels better already. Uh, she's eating like there's no tomorrow. And... Uh, yeah, there's nothing wrong with her appetite. She's been down and everything, so she she now has to make do with um, dry food. No more canned food for her. <laughs> hey, oh my goodness, you two! That wasn't that was an accident. And uh, whoops, boy, am I way behind here? Uh, you know what? I really missed a lot of any potential questions because I got involved with moving the cam there. Um, but Dove is doing really good. For those of you that missed it, what they ended up doing was they, this one here, we already knew that it was a goner because, um, wait, before she went to the, uh, vet's office, we, we soaked it and this tip, whole tip had come off. So that one's gone. It's up to here. This one and this one ended up doing I guess you could call it like an extended D claw on this and this, and then she's so this one's gone, and so she sewed these two fingers together or toes together, and this one has a little bitty thing on it that we're still watching. D claw is okay, but that one's not weight bearing anyhow. So she by by sewing these together, um, it made a bigger pad for her. So that's what we want. Because she ate three bowls of canned food. <laughs> yeah. Well, we've got some really good pain meds. She gets two kinds of pain meds. And um, she actually has this wrapped where it's rare that we actually wrap anything. Um, it's just rare that we would wrap anything with a cat. But in this particular case, because the sutures are there, um, when she jumps down on things, we don't want the pressure of that pulling the tissue away from the suture. So she's got a wrap on it. She's kind of sleepy. Um, she's she's going to do just fine, though. And uh, tomorrow's Saturday. Probably Sunday we'll uh, take that wrap off and then put a new one. And actually, let me go write that down on the board real quick. And I just saw Farah. Where did that rascal go? She, she is such a stinker. <laughs> She, I think that's Pen. I'm going to put her TV in my pocket. Okay. I'll be back. Yeah. Yeah, but she looks good. Yeah. Hi, guys. What's up? Amy's back here working hard at putting together some of those fun things we got last night. Yeah, Farrah. She's a little stinker. So, do we have, um, is Mudgy on that she can help be our cataterry? You know, there's three cats. They're all wonderful here, but three of them are super duper duper wonderful. Web, 
Nant and Pant. I'm telling you, those three, orangey and whiteys, are just super full of love. They're just wonderful. Um, oops, I think I saw Mudgy. Did you say Mudgy? You are ready? Yeah, Nance, this is all your fault, you know. The new cream kitty uh, from J.C. Penney's that was at the Finley Mall. So his name is is uh, Finley, Finley, F-I-N-D-L-A-Y, and his test is negative. And um, he's a nice cat. And I am so upset with myself. I have had no time today to give that poor thing a bath. He doesn't care, but so he's still in um, cats. He's still in Thumper's room. He is one really, really nice cat. Yeah. So, but it's F I N D L A Y is how you spell Finley around here. Yep. There you go. Okay, B's got it. So he's doing really good, but he is negative. We've got his uh, distemperin, his Capstar, his first warmer, his test, of course, and I won't do his flea prevention until I give him his bath. Yeah, that's the one, Stinky. Yeah, so it has been so crazy today that this is the first time ever that I'm going to go to bed without my morning emails done. So if you have been waiting for something from me, <laughs> I'm not going to probably do any more emails tonight. I'm tired and... Um, I never got my morning emails done all the way. I've never done that before. And I didn't even get the blog done. Yep. <laughs> I'm fired again, Drat. So, yes, I have to remember my meds. Thank you. And I will remind, I, that will remind me when I get Farrah her meds. Yes. Okay. So, yeah, it's been a crazy day. Yep. <laughs> so, let's get busy. Oh, that's okay, Dutchie. A lot of people don't really always tell me when they're coming. The biggest thing is if you ever do send boxes, um, make sure if you're sending it from your house, just make sure that it has the return label on it. And if it's... <laughs> I am very, very sorry. The kitties told me that I had to say that too. <laughs> Um, and if you send it like through Amazon or something where it says, um, wait a minute, do we have to email to say we, no, you don't ever have to really email. A lot of people do, a lot of people don't. But if you send it from home, like this one, um, Margaret, Aunt, Margaret H. put her return address, that's all I need. That's all I really have to have. Um, but if you do it from Amazon, you know, like where it says who you're sending it to, you can put um, Friends of Felines Rescue Center or Friends of Felines slash your name, and then your name is on the shipping label, and that way, if they forget to put that, that tag inside, which they do quite often, um, at least it's on the outside of the box, um, but a lot of these from Amazon, you guys are getting good at doing that. Oh, there, like this one. This one is from Jake's Meow Me, and she's got her name, actually, she's got practically her whole name on there. So you can fit it in the um, shipping label somehow, and then that way, even they have a big tendency not to put the name inside, and that way uh, we know who it is. So. This is really cool. Look at look at this. Isn't that neat? <laughs> I like that. So this is from Margaret H. And Margaret H. is oh is from um, North Carolina. That is really cute. Because unique deserves unique. Is this? See, my first thing I think of is our little girl unique, but oh, this is the Laurel Birch. I love Laurel Birch stuff. It says, dogs have owners, cats have staff. That's right. That's from Rita Mae Brown. Jackie volunteers and all. I just could not resist, even though a number of calendars have already arrived. 
I treasure this 24-7 home. Aww. For the laughter, loving, caring, companionship in spirit, tears and sorrow, joy and recovery, lessons in determination, courage and grit, all these cats and humans breathe through. Oh, I love that. The elegance of these photos is equal to the elegance of FFRC and your spirit. Oh my gosh. Thank you for that. That's I really like that. Thank you for the card. Um, so Amy, mm -hmm. maybe we could. Oh, I lost the tape. The tape. The tape. The tape. Let me go get the tape, and we'll okay. take this up. Excuse me, guys. Let me get the other fun thing back here. Or maybe not. Maybe I'll wait till I Can you get it? Here. Let me scoop this. There we go. Girl. I can do it with one hand. Raza will be happy. She she had to, like those. Well, she had to share the pen with all those boxes oh. this morning, but by golly, she did because she had to have a breakfast. That's her pen. Yeah. Maybe if you want to stick that on and then sure. volunteers can read that. I like that. Isn't that I love Royal Birch stuff? Can you believe the data fit in that box? No, no way. <laughs> Look at what Margaret sent. This is a cat, a 2013 Gladstone Media calendar. And uh, it, this is really cool. Margaret, this is really neat. Thank you. Yeah, I know. I grab. Uh, I, uh, today at my desk, I used up part of one of these and one of the small ones. So, um, but I have more of those. I just didn't reach and get them. You know, we use a lot of calendars. We use them. Um, another piece because you put it on the paper. Oh, we use one in the office. We use one in the back office. We use two in here. We use one in Kitty Castle. We use one in Thumper's room. I use one in my house. So we we do we put we have to have a lot of calendars helps us keep track of everything. Okay, we'll just throw that down there too. And this one, oh, cut her. This one is oh, this is from Judy L. Judy L is from Ohio. So she's she's our neighbor. Judy L. She told me something was coming. <gasps> we got poopy things. Oh my gosh. Well, can I give you all these to shove in the thing over nope. there anymore? Nope, that's it. Oh my gosh, look at this. Judy, this is cool. Oh, Kitty, please don't do that. These are, I use so many cards. I love writing thank you notes and, and, I, and letters. These are really cute. They're sunshine, smiles, and laughter will make all things grow. Uh, that's really cool, Judy. And these are, there's a card set here and a card set there. Here a card set. Oh, no, no, Jackie, you're getting off track. So there's three. The same thing. <laughs> there's three card sets. And... Oh, oh, there's Christmas napkin. Thank you. Oh, look at this. There's there's one Christmas tree, a ho, 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 a Santa belt, and the poinsettia. Um, I was thinking just today it would be nice if we had uh, some, some uh, festive Christmas napkins in Kitty Cat Castle, too. Uh, that's really cool. Um... You know what? I'm gonna keep these right, keep the regular napkins. That way, they're not gonna get um, messed up, and I will know for sure where they're at. All right, Amy. There might. I'm pretty sure there's room for appetizers. If you want to put these on the counter in Thumper's room. Mm -hmm. So we've got a whole pile of appetizers. Look at this. See, I'm gonna get them towered, and then I'm gonna hand them to Amy. Oh boy. And it'll look like it's Amy's fault that they spill, but it'll be really my fault. <laughs> I can handle it. Okay, that's a lot. Got it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for that. 
<laughs> you need some volunteer snacks. Mm, we like our snackers. There's also uh, three bags of kitty snacks. Oh, oh, three bags of kitty snacks, which I'll use two of those tonight probably. And look, pop tabs for Kellen. And look, box tabs, box tops. Um, Karen ha uh, teaches some of the classes that some of the homeschool kids go to, and they they're collecting these. I I forget what she told me. Yeah, it's thirty cents for each one of these. They get thirty cents for their their classes, so that that can really add up quite fast. Now that one says ten cents, but this tag says thirty cents. So. Um, so thank you. She will really like that a lot. And then there's also um, a whole bunch of, probably a dozen maybe, uh, Fancy Feast. So Judy, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, the box tabs, tops are little, ooh, little postage size stamp things that's on, oh, like maybe baking things or some cereals and some of the nonprofit organizations or schools. Um, can turn those in for for money for actual cash. Hey Amy, how about if I just hand you these and they can go down in the bottom left? Yeah, thank you, Judy. Thank you. That was a great box. Lots of good stuff in there. Okay, and I'm thinking that Heather is on tonight. Heather, whoops. Oh yeah, this is the one that says box one of two. Um, let me just put this over here because I'm not sure if we have the second one on that. If it's not here tonight, I'll have to call or um, see if I have her email and find out what the scoop is. This one here is the one that we said is Jake's, Jake's Meow Me. I love that name. Um, Jake's Meow Me has sent us a few things in the past, too. Ah, this is great. Maybe I'll just throw these down here for now till we're done. Oh, hey, Jake's Miami, thank you, thank you, thank you. This is a great box of food. These are gravy, gravy. Oh no, it isn't. This is the Whiskers Perfectly Chicken. Um, I'm gonna open up one of these because I don't think we have any back there. And Magenta loves these. Up here in the top right, is there room for one of these trays? Oh, yeah. Yeah, wow. Right, here's the box. Oh, heck with it. Let's just get it all out. There. All right. Two trays. There we go. Okay. Are the both up here? Yeah, we can. Amy's so flexible. This should be she's, she's easy to have here and work with. Um, we got a case of the baby uh, fancy feast, and we have a case of the gravy sensation um, gravy lovers. Gravy lovers. This is another one I always I always pick out of the closet for breakfast, and we've got you know they don't have. We don't have Jake's Meow Me's name on here, so good thing you put that on the front. And we got a case of Friskies, too. These are the meaty bites. Thanks, Jake's Meow Me, for helping us get caught up on our food. Appreciate that. Amy, what do you think? If we just put these back here in the right side closet? You want them out of the... We wouldn't have to. We wouldn't have to, unless it fits better. Hi! What are you doing here, Pam? Huh? What are you doing here? Where's Sarah? Where? Oops. Here, you stay there and wait for me. Okay, Sarah's in a box. You're mine now. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> she was going to go for it. You're mine now. Alright, good girl. Remember the days when she used to eat her, take her pills in the, um, those little pot, pill pockets? The easy days? 
Not anymore. She says, I'm not doing it. Okay, so I lost the... There it is. I, now you have to be careful a little bit. Um, this one is from Kurzweil. Is Kurzweil on tonight? You, what are you doing? You have to be very careful. So this is from Kurzweil. Why don't you sit right there? Another Amazon box. Says a gift note from Nancy G. Enjoy your gift, Kurzweil. And we'll put these right here with that. What she got? What did she send us? We got food. Made for food. Oh, this is another case of that Friskies Sweetie Bites. Well, thank you for that. Yeah, the kitties like these. The, they like they like these. The Nine Eyes and the Friskies and the Fancy Peas. Oh. Maybe then there will be a couple more. And, and it's, oh, that's, that's nice. That fit in there? Yep. Cool. Come here. Those won't. Okay. Want them. They, they can go in the boxes or you want them? No, you can put them in the right side of the closet. Yeah, or now not the cupboard, but the closet back there. Okay. Yep. You know somebody's gotta gonna have to want this boy in December. <laughs> Webster, pants and pants. These guys are just wonderful. This one, this one's pants. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. These guys are so, they're just so wonderful. Hey, look at this. Here's Pam, or here's Nan. She's right here too. Yes, and, oh no it isn't. Sorry, it's Web. It's Webbers. I know, these oranges are awesome. Don't you love it when they rub their noses on you? <laughs> come on, Debbie, you can come. All right, you two go back to sleep. Where's Nia? Huh? And Rudy's in the box down here. Here you go, another box. Here you go, Lyndon. There you go, Lyndon. All right. Oh my gosh, this one is real. Oh, we got two boxes the same, I think. <laughs> Pants, you could move a little. This is from Tippy and Trailer. All right, over you go. Tippy and Trailer. Hey, and if Tippy and Trailer's on this afternoon late, um, Judy and I went, Judy S. and I went out to uh, Kitty Castle and we took all the decorations and stuff out there. So it looks really cute. Yeah, it looks really nice out there. All right. Oh, you just melt me. You know it. Be careful. You'll fall in there. Oh, is it? Whoa. Well, it is. It's Mr. Clean. Oh, my gosh. We, whoops, okay, there, dude. So, we have two boxes of this. Um, Maji, if you would, um, these are the, the gallon. Yeah, there's four gallons in each one of these. So, that's eight gallons of the Mr. Clean. I thank you, thank you, thank you for this. Um, so, in the morning when we do the floor, it's uh, Mr., or it's, no, it's bleach. Then the afternoon, or the early morning, wait, early morning is bleach. The main area cleaning in the morning is um, our D256, and then nighttime is usually the Mr. Clean. And then when we wipe down the walls, that's usually a Mr. Clean or the D256 too. Um, and so we use a lot of this. Yeah, it's, it's a good cleaner where... The others are better disinfectants. This is the better cleaner of them. So we got four gallons of it. Tippy and trailer, thank you for this. Big time thank you. This this will help. This was on our want list too. Do you want to carry can you carry one and I'll carry one? Alright, you gotta go away. Just for a minute. Yeah. Yeah, I'll show you on top of each other.
Notice something on it. It this is one that we we have to hold for later. I didn't see. Did you see in it? Did you I give did. me a clue? I did it. Oh shucks! I saw who it was from, and it's probably gonna be something special. <laughs> did you see that? <laughs> well, that's the <laughs> Yeah. I almost I almost saw a peak. I saw orange, but. That's all I saw. We'll take this one back. All right. Dog on it. You yeah. great. That one's a good question. <laughs> you know, the kitties were outside. Uh, the kitties in here got to be outside all day today. And uh, they loved it. This Here it is, the last day of November. And they were out again. And um, tomorrow's Thursday. We will probably leave. Tomorrow, or, oh, tomorrow Saturday. I have been messed up all week. Tomorrow Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to think. No, we'll probably have to wait till Sunday to leave the cats cold guys out. But it's been. It today was another gorgeous day. So this one. This is from Jill R twenty seven. Jill R twenty seven. I'm still messed up from Thanksgiving week. Jill R. This is the one the cats. Oh, well, no wonder they were trying to get in here. Wow. We have a big bag. <laughs> 27 pound bag of the chicken and rice Prina One. Jill, thank you, thank you, thank you. This is a good food. We like to, we like to use that. Got real chicken in it, and it has the omega fatty acid num the six in there, and something else is in there. Maybe it's a cat. I don't know. Oh. Elvira says they have fun being in there. We've got another bag of dry food. This one's a six and a half pound bag of Ein's. These are the two foods we really like to blend together. And oh, 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 oh. Crown Prince. You all know what the Crown Prince is? Da da da. This is the sardines. Yeah. The Crown Prince is, are the sardines. There's two, four, six, and twelve. There's a whole case of them in here. Jill, thank you for this. I suppose I'll have to share some of that. The kitties can have the dry food. I'll get the sardines. Yeah. Um, these can both go on the counter. And then maybe I can just set this here. Right now. Okay. We mixed up a whole bunch of the dry food, I think it was a couple of days ago. In this one, or in that one? It looks like a little white paw print sticking up there. <laughs> That's one morning I will never forget. Okay, there's going to be a noise because I'm going to stuff the paper in here. What are you doing, Dennis? There we go. You guys had too much fun. Do you want to just stick that out so they don't get yeah. in it? Yeah. Oh, that would be awful. That would be just awful. Look at look at Fifi. 
sleeping on the little Betty bye from last night. That's cute. All right, guys. Do we have to turn this upside down? Nope. Um, gosh, I'm not really sure what who this is from. Hey, what are you doing? Do you all know who this one is? <laughs> This one of my faves. Nope, it's not Tilo. Let me see something here if we can tell them. Yeah. Yep. Shin and Nika Ross has it. Yeah, it's it's our on uh, Denison. His left eye has a little scar on it. Remember when he was a baby? He had that really bad eye. This is really another really nice cat. Um, Baju is right down here. Yes. Oh, don't, you don't have to even look at him. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> You're so pretty. You're so pretty. She wants to go in the house again. Okay, all right. Let's put you down. Yeah, Amy, if you see the Rachel, we should take this vest off. Okay. For the night. Okay, go on, Linda. Oops, no, can't eat these. All right, let's see if we can. Uh oh, figure out who did. Uh oh. I'm, oh no. <laughs> I'm really losing you. Don't want to get to get these. Wow, what? Whoa, do you think, um, maybe, mm -hmm. how about if I pull this out, maybe some of those will go down below it, whatever this is. Um, whoop, whoops. Oh, I wonder if we're upside down. That kind of looks, looks that way. I wonder, maybe we better look for a ladder. <laughs> <laughs> okay, or or should we close it up and keep it and turn it over? <sighs> Oops! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I just can't tell. Maybe because you couldn't find a label either, could you? Yeah, yeah. There's a label. Oh well, then it is right inside. But well, no, I think it's. I think this is the top. Okay. What? Well, maybe we should just. Yeah. Okay. Here, babe. I'll show. All right. Because we have to use our tape. <laughs> Here, we're gonna figure this out one way or the other. Oh yeah, this is really tasty. Well, it's probably the bottom. I think so. Maybe it was loaded wrong. Oh yes! Oh no! <laughs> Alright. We got it. There is a letter. <laughs> I love the letters. This is from Sue. Oh, it is so good. So this label's right. You know how I tell you all sometimes the label like, whoops, baby. Here, in or out, so I can move it. So it's Sue. Oh dear. Sue S. Oh here. Oh there it is. Sue S. And it's Sue twenty three from New York. Sue S. Um, from New York. Okay, now we got it figured out. <laughs> and we're going to read her letter. Clear from New York. It says, while shopping the other day, I saw some cute items and picked these up to send to you. In addition, I included a few mice. I make them for myself, friends, and family. All the cats love them. Please use them how and where you best see fit to serve FFRC. I have only been a part of FFRC for approximately four months. 
while you stream surfing I came across your cam. I love cats so of course I had to sit and watch a while. A few minutes later scurrying across the screen as fast as his little front legs could take him oh, was a tiny black kitten dragging its back legs. I was mesmerized and captivated by this little one. All my life I have had cats and I was it and one always was or is a black kitty. Such incredible souls, wonderful personalities. I asked in chat what the name and story was behind this little one. Someone kindly answered. Every time I would log in, I would wait and watch for Pizzazz to come by and he never disappointed. I can sincerely say that little boy stole my heart. It's an ama it is amazing how you can truly come to love an animal you have never met. You really hit the nail on the head with that name. He, oh, he was Pizzazz. I cried when I heard Pizzazz had passed, but soon after, the tears of sorrow turned to tears of joy and gratitude. Pizzazz had a great life at FFRC. He didn't have a care in the world. He never had to worry about a thing. He had shelter. All his physical and medical needs were tended to. He had limitless food, toys, but most of all, Pizzazz knew what it felt like to be loved by human and feline friends. When it was his time to cross over the Rainbow Bridge, he certainly did so peacefully with a full heart, as every cat should. Pizzazz also left us with an invaluable lesson. Even though the challenges we face in life seem insurmountable, life may knock you down a, a time or two. But if you summon up enough strength, courage, determination, and willpower, nothing can stop you from overcoming them. For the rest of my life, every time I think of little Pizzazz, I can't help but smile from ear to ear. His light and spirit live on eternally in the hearts of all who came to know and love him. I can go on for thousands of pages as to why I love your rescue center. Upon arrival, no matter the animal's current or future medical issues and costs, every cat and kitten is given a chance at the best life possible. Other places would never take the financial responsibility, time and effort in caring for animals with the various medical, physical challenges you have. All animals are God's perfect creations and at FFRC every resident, Kobe's, Porchies, Barney's and in-house residents are treated as such. Thank you just isn't enough for the work you all do. As each new cat and kitten comes to FFRC, each story is more tragic than the next, but watching them on cam, you would never know their circumstances. I don't want to think of what would have been, what would have been had they not found their way to you. They are all happy, healthy, and thriving, and all who reside at FFRC are truly the brightest of stars. Reading updates about them on your wonderful blog and watching their escapades on cam brings so much happiness and laughter into the lives of all who are part of your site and center. So here's to you all, to the kitties of FFRC, past, present, and future, and to all who make FFRC a wonderful place to spend time. Volunteers, admins, mods, chatters, viewers, lurkers, much love. And God bless. Sincerely, Sue. Sue, thank you for this letter. This means this means the world to me, Sue, and I, I appreciate this. You know, I've I've told I've told some of you that um I I have gotten emails from before from people when they've been here when they lose their when they lose their very first cat that they love here and some of them will say you know they don't know how they can come back but they do they do come back um we love these cats and we we dote on them we do whatever we need to do to make their lives as good as what we can and uh, my only wish is that I wish we could, uh, I wish we would never have to say no. I wish we had enough room to take everybody's in, but 
it's impossible, but we try. We do try the best that we can. Thank you, Sue. That that letter is wonderful, and I appreciate that. Yeah, you know when I don't know why this makes me think of it, but you know when we first started the cam, you uh, some of you all out there may remember Albert. Dear Sue, thank you. Albert was one of our first babies that died here on the cam. Yeah. Oh, I know. And I and Bravo and Pizzazz are still both really, really hard for me. But when Albert died, you know, we had already been doing this rescue center for years before that. And before we um, uh, started the webcam, we we'd already been doing this for many years. And I always... I was worried there for a long time what's going to happen when we have our first big death, you know, when something is so uh, kitty, especially is so attached by so many. And I thought I was going to have to leave. I, I thought there's no way I could handle that because, I, I you know, we have to go through it ourselves. We have to help the volunteers with it. And now... We have all of you wonderful people, our lurkers and our chatters, and, and it's hard. And, you know, even though you all out there um, don't physically get to touch these cats, you guys know these cats and kitties. And, and I knew that even with Albert. And I, I, was so, I was so scared on that, and I was so worried. And now I know you, you all, you all got it. You know, you know we... We have deaths that do happen here, but um, you guys got it. You know, you understand what we do here. Yeah, five or two was another hard one. Yeah. So, we love them. Yeah, Albert. Yeah, Kitty Cam. Kitty Cam was one of our first people, was our first person. Right, Kitty Cam? And, uh, yeah, Albert was a tough one. Well, let's see what Sue sent. What are you? Are we supposed to open this? Sue, are we supposed to save this for Christmas, or do we? I think we're supposed to open it. Now. I, I got to. <laughs> Amy made the executive decision. We open it. kind of packer. You pack good. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh wow. Amy, do you think if I hold this stuff we could work that off? It arrives safely too. Oh, it's all. Oh, you so cute. Wow. There we go. Look at this. It's got little paw prints on there. Oh, so come back. Come back to us. And um, it says, have a perfectly perfect holiday. There's the grass garden in here. There's, oh, there's toys. There's a holiday pet collectors. I think they're um, ornaments. There's a, it looks like a, uh, yeah, it's a four by six inch uh, oh, um, frame that has a cat on the bottom. There's some other toys down there, or goodies down there too. So it's a really cool she said, said to open it. Okay, we're going to do it. Come on. There we go. Wow. Trying to be a little neat. <laughs> That's not usually my style. I'm usually, but it's so pretty. It is. I'm usually ripping into everything. Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah, there's a whole bunch of toys in here. 
Look at that. What a cute way to wrap it. And it's the kitty garden. Oh, this is a really, the, the oats, wheat, rye, and barley, but it's in a nice box. And it's got the little round circles. Um, I think that is part of what it grows in, the seeds germinate in. That is really cute. I've never seen the wood box with it. There's a really cool kitty something. Oh, it's a flashlight. Whoop, bet we have to put batteries in. A really cool kitty flashlight. Yeah. And here's the ornament. <laughs> That's cute. Hey, that pretty much kind of looks like Octavia. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is cool. And, and a mousy with catnip in it. That is really cute. Sue, this is cool. I'm going to set this back and we'll kind of show it off to the volunteers for a little while before we do anything else. Oh, gosh, kitties. Oh, you guys, they are loving these boxes. We need just so they don't get in it. How about... Yeah, so we don't get in it yet. You want to tie that around there? Okay, maybe put it up on over here and then we'll keep it safe. Wow. Oh my gosh, there's all kinds of things in here. Amy, or, uh, Sue, you want us to, to open these up right now, then? Hey, Ann Sprinkle, thank you for calling today. Oh. This is, uh, you know, Sue, did you email me on this? Something rings a bell on this. This is a bread and pastry um, baking, a sugar cookie baking mix. There's more in there. Oh my gosh. And it's got chocolate sprinkles, rainbow sprinkles, a spatula, brownie mix, cookie mix, a baking, a baking basket. Isn't that cool? Oh my gosh. Sue, I bet you had some fun with that. Hey, Eagle Spirit. How are you? It's like kind of fun. I know it. Oh, look. What's this? Oh, it's peanut butter cup. Peanut butter and chocolate kettle corn. Oh, my gosh. Here's another. It does? No. Oh. <laughs> I forgive. <laughs> Here's another one. <laughs> it's popcorn. <laughs> hey, you got me. All right, you guys, you can be in there. Just don't mess with the peanuts. But that's why we're in there. This looks like another fun, fun uh, group of something. She says yes. She said you know. Okay, I got you, Dad. I have it on the wall. This day, I'm telling you, these days just get away from me, and then I'm, I'm just. Uh, Home. Sue, tell me, am I? I have to look and see. It seems like you told me something about all these. Look at this. Love me, love my cat. There's that um, indoor truffles, and I'll bet you that one's truffles. And there's that cute holiday ornament again. Isn't this wonderful? And a really nice big mug with pink paw prints at the top. Yeah. Um, maybe one of the mods can undo Sue so she can talk to me a little more and let me know if, if I was supposed to do something special with all these. Look at this. The 50s candy mix. Oh, you guys will remember some of these. Chickle sticks. Gobstoppers, Long Boys Coconut. I remember those. 
um, Mary Jane's, Mike and Ike, Nico Wafers, Candy Necklace, Root Beer Floats, Smarties, Wax Bottles. No, no, no. no. Do any of those sound familiar to you, Amy? A few of them. Yeah, remember that? Not all. Okay, now I remember that. Okay, I remember now, Sue. I knew, I knew there was something. Oh, and here's something for the kitty. So she's going oh, anyway that would benefit us at first. Okay. Oh, maybe the store. This one. Oh. <laughs> From the Cat Perch of Octavia. Dear Mama Jackie, it has come to my attention through the litter to the through the litter vine <laughs> that I am getting a bad rap. <laughs> I need to set some things straight. As you know, she was right up here too. As you know, I am a very good kitty and would never do anything bad. Mm -hmm. I get along very well with my kitty and human friends. I don't understand how or why I would get blamed for stolen packages of food and catnip. I don't have a clue as to who is doing it, really. Hmm, Mama, I sense you don't believe me. Okay, okay. I'll tell you what I know. It's Einstein. <laughs> he is the one who is behind all the FFRC heists. He is so fast and so skilled. You see, curiosity gets the best of me. So when I hear a noise, I have to go and investigate. And literally, in the blink of an eye, a package of food drops right at my paws. Amazing, isn't it? I just always happen to be in the wrong or right place at the wrong or right time, really. The only thing I am guilty of is helping to open the drop packages and facilitating the food to the floor. So all my friends at FFRC can partake in Ines heist. I love my friends here and gladly share. Sharing is caring, right? I am sending this peace offering to start replacing what Einstein has stolen. So now that you know the truth who is really behind the thievery, thievery at FFRC, you can take all the <laughs> you can take all the locks off of the cabinets and put them on Heine's cage instead. I will guard the food. It's all safe with me. Why do I sense that's not going to happen? Okay, I must admit, I do have a soft spot in my heart for Heine, and I know you do too. He can't control his actions, so on behalf on his behalf. I am asking if you choose not to unlock the cabinets once in a while, could you please accidentally leave some food out for him to steal? It's in his blood, and I don't think he can stop. I know you understand. I will be sure to replace what is stolen in the future. Love and purse, Octavia. Thanks for saving my life. And look at that cute little girl. Yes, Octavia is very, very sure that it's it's I mean. <laughs> I gotta save that letter too. Okay, let's see what she sent. Oh boy. Is there all of this? Oh my goodness. Oh Amy, I might need some I better just see you knock it all off. Wow, yep, these are the things. These look like the Ine heist. Oh. A.K.A. Octavia. I just saw her. I know, I just... Or it might have been Georgia. Yeah. <laughs> From behind. Georgia is so pretty. Oh, my. Oh, gosh. Sue, this is awesome. Take a look at this. So, there's... There's... Um, there's a whole case of... Oh, and look how pretty that is. Of appetizers. I wonder if there's room... Right up there for that. Could be the bow on that. Oh, yeah, yeah, maybe we could. And the, the box of the temptation treats that we know they all love, love, love. That's right. Poor little Octavia is so misunderstood. You mean up here, Jackie? Up here? Uh, <laughs> oh, right there. Okay. Amy, oh, you're God. you're facilitating the thievery. Right I can tell. Uh, and oh, this is one of her favorites. Oh my goodness. Isn't that something she loves these? We might have to um put these in the closet though back there till we have a little more yeah. room in there, which will be like in a the day. Yeah. 
because if once both come open, it's history. Okay. Um, she was, if, if, uh, yeah, yeah. If she gets into that before we're ready to put it under lock and key, we're in big trouble. If Connie was here, I wonder if Connie's on there. She'd be saying, oh, she can have the box. Come on. I know. These are really nice. Oh, and look at this one. Oh, oh this is a Godiva chocolatier, a Godiva wonderful mug, dark chocolate and um, hot chocolate mix with Godiva. Oh my gosh. That's cool. Oh, Sue, this is going to be fun. We're, we have to come up with something. Uh-oh, now we're... Now we're having a messy kitty. How are we going to get you out of there? Oh, Snowman Soup. A hand and heart warming blend of our best hot chocolate mix. White chocolate chunks and mini marshmallows. Now, how cute is that? That makes a neat present. And here's some kitty um, mousy toys. Do you want to give those to them now? And key lime cupcakes with cream cheese frosting. So easy and so good. Enough mix to make 12 fabulous cupcakes or 8 minis. Even better than you remember. This is that neat. So all we have to add to this is milk, oil, egg, butter, and cream cheese. It's got the mix in there. These are cool. And this is chocolate truffles, hot chocolate mix, and mint chocolate, hot chocolate mix. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Okay. So, we got to talk and we got some different things we could do to make this even some extra fun stuff. All right, you guys. Sue, you're a good packer. <laughs> Tip, or, uh, I always want to call her Tiffany. Or, yeah. Oh, she's got, yep, she's got them on her. Wow, what's this one? You went all out on these gift packs. These are awesome. Aww. Aww. Can you read what that says? My best friend has fur. There's a truffle. Uh... Coffee, oh, macadamia nut coffee, and the holiday ornament. Aren't they pretty? What is it when they're wrapped like this? It just makes them look even cooler. Oops, I think our chat is floating. Yeah. figure out. Uh, Sue, thank you, thank you. And ran, oh, that, uh, I think I know which one that went into. I saw a little folder thing. I think I did. Be gone in five minutes, yeah. Okay, thanks, Severin. Wow. Yeah, I bet it's in that baking one. Oh, that was bad. We oh, were walking around. Oh, the champions one. We'll just have to accidentally open the seven up here. That one is now. <laughs> hey. I'm good. Do we have news? It's camping. Yep, I, we just got done with the very last cool, cool box. Yes. What's the news? You're sad? Yes. Oh. Oh, by three votes. That really surprises me, too. Wow. Oops. Let me write, them. Let me write that down, though. Okay. So, that one's 114. Okay. Oh, man, that is so close. Okay. 
okay? I am shocked at that. I am just shocked at that. I can't, I am shocked. Ah, oh, that's just not right. Okay, so now, now what's the next scoop now? Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Or could do that right in here. On the cam. Yeah. Yep. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. 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 Very nice today. There's okay. I like that. I love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. Very nice today. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I love it. Love it. I love it. You are awesome. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, well, I'll tell, I'll let the viewers know they. Okay. Some hundred and twelve today. That's okay. pretty good. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll make sure I mention that. Okay, thanks a bunch, Canton. All right, bye bye. We have our votes. Our votes are in. This is so cute. You guys know who won already? <laughs> with the recount procedure. <laughs> okay, this is it. Da 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 da. I need my iPad. I have a. There's the Octavia. Okay, number. There were a total of 312 votes that came in today. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Who took Florida State? So 312 votes. Um, Roland, I'm shocked. What? He only got 39 votes. I just can't believe that. And Jonah got 48 votes. Savan was 111, which makes da 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 da. Our new mayor of Cats Cove is Anani. Anani did it. He won. He won. It must be his young blood in on that. Got got him all those votes. So Anani is the new mayor. Jonah, I know. Jonah um, is going to probably be ticked off <laughs> for a while. Savan will probably sit on Anani, and Roland will probably roll on roll on Anani. That's what Roland does. Yes, the measers rule. <laughs> so um, Saturday or Sunday, we're going to have a swearing in of the new mayor right here, and I will put in the uh, blog when when it is today's Friday oh so it'll have to today is Friday right I am so messed up this week it'll be Sunday sometime it will be Sunday the swearing in of the mayor yeah he's got to have a speech he's got to have a have a swearing in party and he's got to have a swearing in object that he swears on so we got to do all this yet and they're expecting a banquet out there also so, Savon came in second. She lost by three votes. Oh, I should have voted. Yeah, wait, who is the secretary of the farm? That would probably probably be Mama out there. So, yeah. So, Anani was 114, Savon 111, Jonah 48, and Roland. I, that one really surprises me. Only got 39. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. All right, so um, tomorrow there'll be uh, things on uh, on uh, Rita's website on it. Uh, well, where I should say on the Facebook, and then in the blog tomorrow. Um, <laughs> yeah, there, there in the blog tomorrow. I'll, I'll mention what time the swearing-in party is for Sunday. So. <laughs> Somebody probably did pee on those ballots. 
Oh, gosh, that was fun. Uh, Canton is just brilliant. She is just awesome. And her sense of humor, I just treasure. So, <laughs> all right, well, we're going to clean up a little bit. I'm going to put this wonderful thing that Sue got together till we figure out something really cool to do, how we're going to do it. And um, we'll get the playground set up, too, as well. And if Heather, Heather R. is on, um, I'll still keep track of the second box, too, that's going to come, okay? So we'll see what's going on with that. Yeah. So how is Dove? Dove is doing great. She's sleeping very peacefully. Or maybe she's just wide awake napping. I can't quite tell. But she's eating really good. I'm going to give her pain meds here in just a little bit and get her through the night. And uh, she's going to do she's going to do good with this. I was really concerned about what they were going to have to do um, because it was looking pretty ugly yesterday. Um, but if you want up to you, that's it. Yeah, I guess so. Um, so, but it turned out far better than what I thought, and far better than what the um, what the vet had thought too. Wanda, I did. I have it on my counter, and I was going to send that or do that tomorrow night when I didn't have so many boxes because I want to uh, share that with everybody. And Wanda, you're just, you have a real gift there. Absolutely a beautiful gift. Her leg is going to be okay. The big thing that was a big worry today is um, when I, when I clean that um, and that whole toe, end of the toe, came off um, it, there was a lot of pus and whenever you see that you know you worry about how far up it's going but leg looks really good so I'm real happy okay well I'm gonna I think I missed some questions and if I did I'm really sorry Anani's a boy yep oh who is the first lady cat ooh about to ask Anani that Goosey, thank you. I appreciate that. Um, seems like I had one more thing. And Dove did not cry. No, I think I cried today for her. Oh, okay. And what do you want, Missy? What do you want, Missy, girly? You little sweetheart. Here, why don't you sit here a minute? Let me clear this off. Okay. All right. And then I have a favorite ask of the mom. Show them this. Mm -hmm. uh, do you want the styrofoam too much left in this? Come on. Oh, to order the kitty in there. I didn't know that. Yeah. Sorry about that. So, moderators, I know somebody somewhere tonight is going to get worried to pieces about this. Um, Fair has had her meds. See the holes on there? Remember this? We had a toy very similar to this one time. And at that time, we had some little, little, little kitties. And one of the little kitties had um, gotten their head stuck in these, these sores. Or, I'm reading at the same time. In one of these holes. Um, the kitties that are out here tonight cannot not get their head stuck in there. So, yeah. Well, no, it wasn't all night. No, we caught it. We caught it fairly quick. Um, I think somebody called me or something, but it was a little while. So, moderators, as people notice this tonight, let them know um, everybody's heads are too big for it. So, um, tomorrow when the babies are out, the two push babies are out, we'll make sure that this is up for a while. So, this will be fun for them tonight. They can go in it on both sides and on top of it and play. Can you help me, honey? Uh -huh. No, you don't. 
Hello, Hello.